Good afternoon, folks. It's Saturday, April 17th, 2010, and I haven't done a video blog for about, well, it's been a week. Um, it was a bad week for working out this week. Uh, I didn't work out, well, I haven't worked out since last Wednesday. So, and when I went and worked out today, I could really tell that I had not been going to the gym. Um, I only did 10 minutes on the elliptical today because after 10 minutes my legs were feeling like jello. Of course, I was doing it at a pretty fast pace though, so. But um, I did the elliptical for 10, then I did 20 reps on um, the chin up machine. I did uh, both rowing machines and the rest of the, the strength weight machines. Um, all 5 pounds, so that was good. I have not lost weight, but it's redistributing itself because my clothes are fitting different and I'm looking, I'm starting to notice little septal changes. So, but I want to lose the weight. So, and I know what I got to do to lose it. I've got to get off the Pepsi. And I mean completely off of it. Uh, just doing that by itself, I should drop the weight and we're trying to eat healthier. We're doing more grilling now that grilling season is wide open. We're eating yogurt for snacks. Uh, we're trying to eat our larger meals earlier in the day and we taper the meals off as we go as it gets later at night and um, we're eating like more salads and things like that and uh, so we're trying to cut out the late night snacking that's uh, really bad and we need to learn portion control we need to start measuring food out I'm using a smaller plate and that actually does help I don't know it must trick the mind or something I don't know but it helps I'm getting hypnotized Monday night and I'm getting hypnotized to quit smoking and I really really hope that it works and um, they're doing uh, they're hypnotizing people for to stop smoking for weight loss and for stress relief so I don't know if you can get hypnotized for all of them at one time or not but that's okay because if we can only do one I'm definitely going to do the stop smoking thing since I'm already aware of my overeating and doing the portion control and exercising and all that so um, I don't think I need to be hypnotized for that although it would help I'm guessing so uh, hey kudos to the Paris Police Department they've been stopping speeders left and right on my street there's a public park just down the street and there's all kinds of kids on the street and the speed limit is 20 miles an hour and people fly through here doing 50 60 miles an hour with no regard to who's out in the street or on the sidewalk or whatever I'm just surprised the kid hasn't been hit yet but big kudos to the Paris Police Department for sitting on the street and catching those speeders. I cheer every time I'm outside and, and they catch one. And I know the drivers hear me cheer and I don't really care because they shouldn't be speeding in the first place. I mean, I'm not Lucy Law, but, um, yeah, don't speed down my street. So, don't speed, period. <laughs> Although, I have been guilty of speeding myself, but I do all mine on the interstate. I know it doesn't make it any better, but still. Anyway, oh, I want to give some shout-outs today. I want to say congratulations to Amy. She has rejoined Weight Watchers and is getting out of the house and exercising and all that. So congratulations on that, Amy. Congratulations to Jen. Yay, Jen, for getting on that treadmill and working it, girl. I knew you could do it. Um, way to go, Karen, for staying dedicated to your workouts, even when your life is just crazy. Um, you're a real inspiration. And uh, I hope your dad's okay. Let me know. So, oh, Pam, you so rock, girl. You rock. Yeah, congratulations for sticking to your guns and um, doing away with old rubbish. Let's put it that way. You know what I mean. Um, I want to give a shout out to Charity and Steven. Hey, y'all. I am so proud of you two for saving up to join the YMCA, and I can't wait until you join, and then we can all go work out together and go swimming together and all that good stuff. Um, awesome, awesome workout today, honey. I'm talking to Darren. Shout out to my hubby. Um, I am so proud of you. Uh, Darren hasn't worked out for a couple weeks because he's been really sick, 
and he went today and he worked out and uh, he worked out hard so and I'm really proud of him Bobby shout out to you son congratulations on getting your new job and I'm glad you like it and I know you're going to do good in it so keep up the good work son shout out to Dana I haven't told you this well I have told you this but I don't think you listen I am so proud of you for losing all that weight people my son lost well he's probably lost up to 80 pounds now a month ago it, he had lost 60 pounds already and he did that simply by getting off of the pop he gave up his pop and he has switched to water and uh, he drinks he likes lemonade and everything and he has just shed that weight he's he's not even a shadow of his former self he has just lost so much weight and he looks fantastic so kudos to you Dana um, and a shout out to Becca and I just want you to know that I really admire your dedication of working out and I mean your life is crazy too and you hardly ever have time to just stop and breathe but you go to the Y every morning and you work out and you go running and all that so you know you're, you're really ins you're really inspirational to me so oh and thank you so much for the cornhole bowls boards and um, Darren got those finished and all that so and he's eager to learn how to play um, oh and you're also an inspiration with your gardening you all would not believe this girl she just does everything speaking of gardening I have 97 tomato sprouts I planted a bunch of tomatoes inside and I've got 97 of them sprouting is that not awesome and I hope they all turn into great big bushy plants and yield lots and lots of tomatoes. We've got the beefsteak tomato variety. So, because the prices of tomatoes is absolutely ridiculous. Three dollars for a little bitty Roma tomato. Come on. I'm not paying that. So, we're growing our own. And along with the tomatoes in our garden this year, we are going to have snow peas, cauliflower, cucumbers, zucchini, bell peppers, carrots, iceberg lettuce, green beans and I'm also growing some chives because I love chives on my baked potato so and they're expensive too fresh chives taste better anyway so okay oh I've been through all my notes already so what else today I don't know I'm at a loss for words yeah me <laughs> oh I did a new opening for my video do me a favor and comment and let me know what you think about it. So, I guess um, I can close. And I'll just say that um, I'll try to get a couple more video blogs up this week. I still not have not got the cables for my camcorder so that I can transfer those video blogs over to the computer so I can upload them. I really need to get that done. And um, as soon as I finish doing this, I am going to work on that project the slideshow that I've been talking about and not doing I mean I just haven't done so and I'm not doing any retakes anymore total honesty you get to see my screw ups anyway you guys have a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon bye <laughs>